For people who work far away from home, spending all that time in a remote location can be challenging. You're away from your friends and family, you spend all day with the same people, and you definitely miss the comfort of your own bed and a home-cooked meal. Sometimes it feels like the days are endless. That's what it must have felt like for the workers on a Thai oil rig who spent months out of the year hundreds of miles away from the shore. But when something floated by their rig one day, the day-to-day -day monotony was all but forgotten in the ensuing life-or-death situation. It was a bright day for the workers of an oil rig 135 miles off the coast of Thailand. With the sun shining, the water all around them was a crisp blue. It seemed like nothing could go wrong. But that's when one worker noticed something in the water. It was a dog. The workers couldn't believe their eyes. Somehow the pooch had managed to make its way over a hundred miles away from the shore and was approaching the oil rig. It was certainly giving new meaning to the term doggy paddle. Baffled, the men wondered what a dog was doing splashing around in the middle of the ocean. They didn't have time to think about it for very long though. He was clinging to a pole, exhausted, and the water wasn't going to stay calm for long. In fact, as the dog swam for its life, the waves were only getting bigger. With no telling as to how long the dog could cling to the rig, a few of the men came up with an interesting solution. They fashioned a harness out of some rope they had on the rig, and slowly dropped the contraption down into the water. Their goal was to secure the dog in the rope and lift him out gently, but they had no idea if the crazy plan would work. Knowing a dog's life was on the line, the men lined the edge of the rig, dunking their rope into the water, trying to loop it around the pooch's belly. This proved more complicated a task than they'd imagined, like they were playing a claw machine game. After 15 minutes of careful maneuvering, they successfully got the dog out of the water. Just in time, too. You can imagine how happy the pup was to finally be on solid ground, but he wasn't in the clear yet. He wasn't in great shape, understandably. Soaked to the bone and shivering all over, the pooch wasn't making any noises whatsoever. The workers were worried they were too late. Luckily, once he warmed up a bit, the pup seemed to be past the worst of it. Workers gave him some meat and a hefty bowl of water from the rig, and he lapped it right up. With the dog safe, however, the workers only had a thousand new questions to answer. The first off, he needed a name. The workers knew he'd survived only because of chance, so they gave him a name to fit. Boonrod, which in Thai means, he has done good karma, and that helps him to survive. The next question, though, was the toughest to answer. What were they supposed to do with him? Thankfully, several hours removed from the frigid water, not to mention a quick power nap, Boonrod's condition was improving. He was even smiling. But he had no bed, and, for the time being, no owner. So the men built a makeshift cage for Boonrod on the rig, where he could be safe with a warm place to rest. As an added bonus, the reinforced cage also allowed the crew to safely move the dog to a ship if the time came. By the end of the second day, Boonrod looked to be on his way to a full recovery. He was regaining his strength and was enjoying being around people again, and the crew was enjoying having a furry friend around. But there was still one mystery left to be solved. No one knows how a dog came to end up over 135 miles off the shore in the middle of the open ocean. Some speculated Boonrod accidentally fell off the side of a fishing boat, or intentionally jumped from a ship where he was being abused. After two days on the oil rig, Boonrod was successfully moved to the mainland and given real medical care. The treatments were funded by Watchdog Thailand, a nonprofit that helps needy animals in the country, and the pooch met the medical pros in style. As the workers had wanted Boonrod feeling as pampered as possible, They'd strung a gold floral wreath around his neck and let him play with all his new admirers coming to give him a checkup. It's hard to imagine this dog was lost at sea just days before, but still, the workers were worried they'd overlooked a health problem. But by the end of his medical care, Watchdog Thailand confirmed that Boonrod was doing well and thriving. The dog was probably happy enough with some food and a safe place to rest, but the nonprofit went above and beyond. Still, his future wasn't set. Where would he live? Well, one of the workers on the oil rig, Vitisak Payala, said that if no one came forward to claim or adopt Boonrod, he'd bring the pup home himself. Vitisak was the photographer who captured Boonrod's entire harrowing journey, so he probably had an extra level of sympathy for the pooch. And sure enough, 
When no one arrived to claim Boonrod, Vitasak took the dog home with him. I'm sure he was secretly hoping that would happen all along. Just look at that face. The story immediately went viral, and people across the world were logging on to follow Boonrod's saga from waterlogged dog to happy pup. Vitasak was happy Boonrod was received so warmly, but insisted that he didn't want donations to help take care of him. And Boonrod is totally in love with his new home. The pair are extremely happy together. It's not every day that a dog captures the heart of millions, but after all the hardship Boonrod had to suffer, it's not surprising that he did. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with your friends and family. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next one.